good. We're in Wales and we're about to set off up Snowdon. You ready? First shine to the day of river crossing and we've only come this far. So, Snowdon by uh, Kribgoch. Uh. <laughs> Snowdon really. by Kribgoch, <laughs> which Sarah's never done. I've done quite a few times, usually from Penny Pass car park, which is at the top of this road here, but the rules have changed and that's now 25 pounds to park. Pre-book And you have to pre-book, which we're not about. So we've come down for the cheap free scumbag parking, which means we've got to do a much bigger walk. You excited? That's a face of pure joy there. <laughs> I'm excited. been going for just under an hour we've come quite a decent distance really just getting up onto the sort of bottom of the north ridge that joins up with Kribgoch so it's about to get really fun after this burner climb I'm feeling pretty good though I'm feeling like all the lockdown training all the workouts have really helped and my legs are feeling pretty decent you're feeling a bit more yeah I don't know what's happened because I was also doing a lot of training but I just have a lot of lactic acid build up in the legs right now and I don't know why. Yeah. So I'm just trying to push through it and take my time. It's actually coming up really quickly. We uh, came over the ridge back down there and it felt like it was suddenly all out in front of us. Hang on, let me change to super wide angle so we can see everything. So we came over the ridge and suddenly this entire area opened up and at first it looked monstrously big but as we're moving through it suddenly you find that stuff's coming closer to you a lot quicker than you'd expect but yeah we're going to be going up along to the summit up there and then all the way along here god I really hate walking up screens Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. That got, um, ridgy. <laughs> mm. Oh, sick. Sarah's just gone on ahead and I'm going to try and get a couple of shots with the 100-400. Maybe, maybe throw the drone up. Really pleasant weather today. It's like no wind at all. Very nice temperature. Just looks pretty sick. Turn around and walk. Very quick drone flight. Yeah, are you okay to try and walk along that ridge a little bit? Because it looks quite nice. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, and then if you just keep going up to the top and I'll just catch up. My first time using this little bag and uh, quite liking it. I got it so that when I'm doing days like today and I don't want to take my full kit out, I've got something that's going to keep on my gear nice and safe. And that can go in there quite nicely. Now, I need to rush and try and catch up. So, let's see you when we're up on top of this. Nice. 
Oh, hey. Oh, fuck yeah. This is the summit of Crib. Oh. The start of the ridge. Summit. I think this is. Although that looks higher. Well, let me just stand there just in case. This <laughs> is the start of Crib anyway. On that peak there, someone stood 85 with Snowden behind. Yeah, do you want me to go? I can do. Wow. All that, and now I need to go back. So let's do that. But I think Sarah's probably going to shoot me. So I'll have the camera out for a little bit and then I'll put the camera away. trying to head along, get some shots as we're going, but we're aware we both quite like the summit still today. But it's getting later in the day and the more time we spend on here shooting, the less time we have to get up on the summit, which is all the way up behind Sarah there. So we're gonna see what it's like when we get to the other side. And if we're gonna be able to. This is nice. Look up. Nice. So we're about three quarters of the way through crib. Hi. This is what we've got ahead. So what we're thinking is when we get just oh the God, other side of these. Right there. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Hello. We're gonna drop down here and follow this path up and try and hit the summit really quickly because we think going up here and along will probably take us a bit too long. Crib done. Are you stoked? Did it. Good job. Now we've actually got the probably sweaty hard bit of getting at the top of that. So we've had a slight change of plan. We've actually stayed higher up. Sarah found through some intuition that I didn't have a path that runs along at this sort of altitude, which is going to save us the effort of going down and back up or going up and back down. So we're going to try and just traverse along this and hopefully get on the summit before too long because it's already five o'clock and it's shaping up to be a late day. I'm surprised by how quick we seem to be covering ground. I don't know if it's just because we're both used to Scotland where everything feels a little more grand or stretched out, but it feels that within no time at all, you've sort of moved twice as far and everything seems twice as close as you think it should do. But we've already come a real great distance within a very short space of time and very wide angle lens on the GoPro, but the ridge line here really doesn't seem that far away anymore. I'll see what Sarah thinks, if I can catch her up, because she's done this thing where, I didn't tell her this, she doesn't watch the vlog, so it's actually not a bad chance to speak about her and her not know. But she can be quite slow at times, but then other times she'll just be like an absolute rocket and I have to actually be moving real fast to keep up. This is one of those times where she's flying along. You're flying along. You're absolutely flying. Yeah. I've shared my life location so Aisley might just rock it at some point. You have a little friend. So our friend Alia who hasn't been on the vlog before, 
but we've done a lot of cool stuff with. <laughs> he lives very, very close. This is his back garden and he's finishing work very shortly. And knowing how quick he is, I'm expecting him suddenly just to appear out of nowhere. He's just gonna poke his head over the next rock and be like, yeah. hi. Yeah, look at that black cell there. Yeah, that's very black cell. Those two. Yeah, black cell shot. Oh yeah. Wow. What a view. Over a decade since I've been up here. So sick. Here you go. What? Oh, he's there. Oh, oh there so is. cute. Stand up. <laughs> Stand up. Oh. He is so cute. So cute. That bird has instantly clocked this sandwich. He was further away. He's clocked it. I know what you're doing, mate. I know your game. Soggy, sweaty bag sandwich, but delightful. Brownies, fuck off. You're not having any food. So we're just heading down now. We've had a, what, a nice little half hour chill, haven't we? Half hour chill on the top, a few other people up there, but quite nice and peaceful. Didn't bother flying the drone because it was peaceful and with the other people up there, thought no one wants a little buzzy, little buzzy drone going around. Did not want to ruin the vibe, no. We were being considerate. Considerate yeah. citizens. Considerate walkers. We didn't do it for the ground. Sarah to wrap up her story. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. I think you'll like the series. Yeah. Hopefully, we'll see. You're in Let's it, so watch. you should like it. Oh my ass! Oh! <laughs> that fucking hurt. Okay, this is kind of disgusting how colour coordinated I am. Like. On point. Very disgusting. You know, even the grey of the leggings matches the bag. I know. Oh. There we go. Almost back up on the tippy top of Krubgok again, hoping to see Alia somewhere further down on the ridge. Big day, but good sound. It's gonna be a corker of a sunset. Look at this. Beautiful. Beautiful. Absolutely no sign of area though. No. Very I spotted them. Um, Where are they? Further down that way. I saw two people running. <laughs> they were both running along the fucking ridge, and I was like, that's, them. that's gonna be them, isn't it?
Right, sir. Turn your head torch on, please. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Of all the meeting places. <laughs> Just look down at the rocks, please. Yeah. Thank you. I like it. I think it's probably going to be too dark for many more videos, so I'm going to call it there. We're going to make the rest of our way down to the van and try and get some warmth. But very good day so far. <laughs> A lot of fun. Let's go.